Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Today's video is going to be a current favorites. My plan was to film this a couple weeks ago and it was going to be my end of summer favorites, but it is the first day of fall today officially. So we're gonna talk about the products I've been loving recently. Some are going to be good for the fall, some I used throughout the summer, and some are random. So yeah, this will just be a good old classic favorites video. I love these videos. So get cozy, get a drink. I have my pumpkin candle burning. It's the pumpkin brulee candle from Target and it smells so good. I feel like fall doesn't officially start until I actually put like a pumpkin smelling thing in this room. And so it started people, let's go. I'm gonna start off with makeup and the first thing I have to share with you guys is this Stone Cold Fox palette from ColourPop. I cannot remember the last time I purchased a palette in store and I was really excited about this. I had actually been eyeing it for a while on the website and then they had it at Ulta so I picked it up and I've been looking for the perfect cool tone palette. I have tons of warm palettes and I definitely gravitate more towards cool and especially going into the fall and winter and this one has such a good variety of shades. I have been thoroughly enjoying it and I've been mostly dabbling in the matte shades. I've been using Drama Mama a lot for my winged liner um, which I had done a video on TikTok and Instagram so I'll link that down below if you want to go see my little trick. It's very quick and easy and yeah I've just been thoroughly enjoying this palette. The mattes are beautiful, great to travel with and the colors really get me excited and I've been using it pretty much every single day since I got it. A couple of face products that I have been absolutely loving. This one is the foundation I'm wearing today. This is the Shiseido Synchro Skin Radiant Lifting Foundation. It's oil-free and it's kind of like a skincare foundation. It leaves the most beautiful finish on your skin. It looks just like skin. The color match is really lovely and it blends in really, really nicely. So I've been really, really enjoying this and it kind of was one of those products I got in PR that was a little bit more surprising. On a whim one day, I was like, I need a different colored foundation so I have to switch something out because it wasn't gonna match me. And then I tried this out and I thoroughly loved it. It also wears really nicely. I've worn this for quite a few hours and even after my skin still looks like super radiant and glowy um, and like, it just wears really nicely and looks really natural. So highly recommend that. Another one that I've been loving and used all throughout the summer is the Charlotte Bill. <laughs> I haven't talked to the camera in a while. Uh, the Charlotte Tilbury Beautiful Skin Foundation. This is the shade four neutral. So this is my tan shade. And this is also a really beautiful glowy foundation, very full coverage. This one, by the way, also is pretty full coverage too, um, but in a nice way, not too cakey or anything. And yeah, I really like this. I love the other Charlotte Tilbury foundation quite a bit, but this is kind of a nice, bit of lighter kind of coverage for the summertime. I do want to get a couple more shades of this possibly, and I also like that it has a pump, but that is one of my most used products of the summer by far. And another Charlotte Tilbury product that I used all throughout the summer and will continue to do so and actually pairs really nicely with both of those foundations is their cream bronzer. This is a beautiful skin sun kiss glow bronzer. This one is in the shade two medium and it's a cream bronzer, but it does kind of dry down into a bit of a powder. It's really, really nice, blends in really nicely. As you can see, I've kind of squished my brush in there. It has a nice big mirror as well. And I really like the shade, blends in really nicely and just gives you a really nice healthy glow. I'll even use this on bare skin if I'm not doing too much makeup just to kind of liven up my face. But this is definitely worth the money. I know Charlotte Tilbury is expensive and sometimes it's just nice to invest in products that are going to be well used and loved. And this one is definitely one of those for me. I did want to keep this video a little bit more condensed. So that is all of the makeup. The next thing I have is actually a makeup tool or beauty tool. And my my apologies she's a little dirty because I haven't cleaned her in a while but this is the beauty blender blender puff and it is so great for pressing in your powder I use this all throughout dance show season and it's just a really great product to have backstage to press into your powder and really mattify everything very quickly it has a little slip so you can put it on like this it also has another little grippy thing so if you like that better and it's just a really great product I have other powder puffs but nothing compares to this and I think there are dupes out there but when I saw this I just picked it up from Sephora and I quite enjoy it perhaps this is something you'll want to pick up during the Sephora sale I think it's coming up next month it's a really great product and tool to have on deck and I've really enjoyed having it as for skincare recently I've been keeping it pretty simple I have been trying out a few new products here and there but for the most part pretty much keeping it the same to my use to the people my belief you know 
my basics kind of in that realm. However, when it comes to tan, I have used the Coco and Eve Tanner pretty much all summer, the mousse. I've mentioned that on my stories. And this is a new product from Saint Tropez. This is their Lux Tan Tonic Drops. And this is just a self tanning serum for your face. And this is amazing. I quite enjoy this because I find that this is the most natural looking. It is not too dark or harsh and you can obviously build it up if you want to but I notice a huge difference in my skin and my glow when I use this in the morning after a couple hours I'll have a bit of a tan but nothing too like streaky or stark which is really nice I love the scent of it too which might not be everyone's cup of tea but I quite enjoy the scent and I find it to be a really nice hydrating serum it feels really good on the skin and yeah they did a great job with this self tanner and I find that self tanners I always try them I have so many self tanners for the face and it's really hard to find one that works doesn't break me out and you know is just a really good product this has been a winner so far and I have used quite a bit even though it only shows that much gone <laughs> okay jokes I do have one more beauty tool and that is this eyelash curler from Shiseido it is so good and if you know you know that I was a diehard for the Lise Watier eyelash curler for the better part of my life <laughs> And I do not take to new eyelash curlers as well. I have tried so many and none have been good enough to replace the Lise Watier one, except for her. She is so good and she comes with me everywhere. And I like put it in my Lululemon bag, I put her in my makeup bag, she's always around. Even on no makeup days, I'll always curl my lashes still. It just makes me feel a lot better and put together and opens up my eyes and makes me look somewhat awake and it's a fantastic eyelash curler and I cannot recommend it enough. I know that it's kind of a cult favorite, I believe, and there's good reason for it. This next favorite is kind of a random, but I got a ton of ads for this toothbrush on my Instagram and online and stuff and I eventually just went to Shoppers Drug Mart and purchased it and I'm so happy I did. I really, really enjoy it. It's from Philips and it has this cute little travel case that you open up like this and then you pop your little toothbrush out and it is electric. It just does a little bit of a vibration like that. It goes for two minutes and it does a vibration switch every 30 seconds. So you can go from your top outside to top underneath, bottom and then inside. And then yeah, it's really great. I haven't had to charge it yet, which is kind of crazy because I've had it for probably three weeks now and using it morning and night and it doesn't need to charge. So it holds a battery really, really well. And the way you charge it is just open this and then it comes with a USB cable. Super, super easy. I love the color of it. I love how it comes with a travel case and it feels good when I brush my teeth and I feel really fresh so if you're in the market for a new toothbrush and you like electric toothbrushes I really recommend this okay let's get into hair I have been absolutely loving the JVN products if you don't know this is Jonathan Jonathan Van Ness's line and they are so so good and the price point I checked on Sephora most of the products are really affordable I think a lot of them sit in like the $30 price range so that's really fantastic for such high quality products and I have three products here that I use pretty well consistently every time I wash my hair I have the conditioning mist the blowout styling milk and then the instant recovery serum so this just goes on the ends it's quite a thick serum and I really like it the ends of my hair always get super dry and you just need like a very little scoop really really lovely and everything smells good like so so good and stays in your hair smelling good which I really appreciate the blowout styling milk is the newest product to me but this is just a nice thick cream I kind of run that kind of roots down not in the roots but like here down mid mid down and then this is a spray and it is a little bit more of kind of a, an aggressive spray and all of the products I have talked about this before but all of them are super hydrating so if you have thick hair like me or really dry or coarse hair I think you're gonna really like these products like I said you can get them at Sephora and if I had to recommend anything it would probably be the blowout styling milk first um, just because I feel like this is a universally good product if you do blow dry your hair but I also do really love the instant recovery serum I do think this is more of a unique product and is really nice to put in the ends of your hair to keep them hydrating and fresh and yeah the packaging is all glass everything's really really luxe feeling and smells really good and I've just I've really been loving it and so is my hair continuing on with hair I got a new hairbrush at Target recently this is a another wet brush and it is so good I had a pink one that was meant for like adding shine to your hair before but I wanted something that would get a little bit more into my scalp and really brush things out and tangles and as you can see this has a bit of a curve so it like fits nicely against your head and I love it the hair is really easy to get out of it after and it's really really just a nice experience brushing your hair so if you're again in the market for a new hairbrush highly recommend this I really really like it and another thing I have been using consistently is this kitsch microfiber 
hair wrap towel and I have been using this to dry my hair since I got it. I have thrown it in the wash and the dryer and it comes out perfectly fine, soft and fresh every single time and it is so great and I feel like my hair has really been taking well to not rubbing my hair with a regular towel and instead using this. So once I get out of the shower, I'll wring my hair out as best as I can, flip my head over, use this and put this on and kind of squeeze out the moisture for at least a few minutes before I take it out, add my product and then blow dry. I just find that having my hair be soaked up with this has been so much better obviously than a regular towel and so I try to implement that every single time just to, you know, make my hair super healthy. I've also been using the Kitsch um, silk pillowcase and I really like that too so I'm trying my best to use like little things here and there to make my hair super soft and shiny and I do think it has helped a lot and this is just really cute and I really like it so yeah all of the Kitsch products are amazing and I feel like they have just really great tools and I just love their branding too so yeah hair towel I've been wanting one for a while finally got one and it's worth it. Just a few products left. I wanted to mention this Kapari Tahitian Vanilla Ultra Restore Body Butter because I don't know if I've mentioned any Kapari products in favorites videos, but they are also one of my absolute favorite brands, especially during the summer. All of their stuff is kind of geared towards summer and hydration and coconut and smelling really good and tropical. And I just love their stuff so much. However, this lotion is going to be fantastic for the winter because it's very thick and it smells warm and it's vanilla-y. It's not too like, you know, citrusy. And it's so good. It is so creamy, makes my skin feel so hydrated and nourished and the scent lingers, which I personally like in a lotion. I'm also currently using the body wash that goes along with this in the same scent. Fantastic. I cannot recommend it enough. I love Kapari products and they're just so luxe and I feel so good when I use them. If it's been a minute since you've seen my videos, you may or may not know that I actually came out with a tote bag collab with Rue. So this is the Rue X Mick tote and I, feel like I haven't shown enough love to it on social media because I'm generally like using it. <laughs> I use this pretty well every single day. If I'm going to the post office and I have Poshmark items to mail, it's going in the bag. If I'm getting groceries, it's going in the bag. If I have things to bring to dance, it's going in the bag. I love this bag. It holds so much stuff. It's so durable. I was using a different tote the other day for grocery shopping and the strap broke when I was like holding it. So. I had to transfer everything into this bag and I should have known from the start that this is a bag I should have brought into the store. If you want to get your own Rue X Mick tote, all of the designs are unique. We have the same kind of pattern, but each are cut differently because we don't waste any material. I will of course have a link down below. There are a few left if you wanna go check them out. They make great gifts. And like I said, it's huge. It's so great and it's, you know, perfect for back to school, perfect for trick or treating. I don't know if you're doing that or if you have kids that are doing it. This would hold a lot of candy, just saying. And then it does have a little pouch on the inside that you can kind of fold all of it back into. So she's compact, she's cute, she's portable. And yeah, I absolutely love this bag. We used it all summer long, like seriously all summer long. It was the best bag to have for pretty much everything. So I wanted to mention it again, let you know they're still available. Link down below if you want to check them out. I did want to end on a random note and share with you guys a food-ish favorite I've been loving. It's not food, it's a drink. It's the Liquid IV Energy Multiplier Energy Drink Mix, and this is the flavor Yuzu Pineapple. I picked this bag up at American Costco, and it tastes so good, and I love Liquid IV. I'm such a stan. They are so great for days you feel like you haven't had enough water, days you had too much to drink the night before, or days that you are, you know, doing dance shows and stuff and need to be really active. And this flavor is amazing. It tastes so, so good. My other favorite flavor is the strawberry, which you can also get at Costco. And I'm sure you guys are well aware of Liquid IV. No surprise to anyone, but this new flavor is fantastic. And I do like that it has energy in it because I find that that's often something I'm needing if I need a little caffeine boost. So yeah, I just wanted to mention it. If you've seen this flavor and you've been curious about it, but you haven't purchased it, go ahead and purchase. If you like pineapple, you're gonna love it. And that is everything I wanted to mention in this current favorites video. Please let me know in a comment down below any product you've been loving lately and give this video a thumbs up if you want more videos like this from me in the future. And I will see you guys in my next video. Have a great day. Bye.